Hello, hello. How yous doing? Can you hear me? Hey, how's it going, folks? I hope everyone is gearing up for a very Merry Christmas. I hope everyone's having a good week. I spent most of my today just wrapping gifts and trying to get things together. Yeah, how y'all doing? A new addition to the RT addiction list. Uh, unfortunately, this combines elements of all the other ones, including gambling. Gambling's the worst part of it. <laughs> Oh, God. I'm, like, simultaneously happy that Spiff introduced this to me, but I also hate him for it. <laughs> um, but I wanted to get in one more stream of it. Uh, before... We kick off with the Christmas special streams. Because this is gonna be the last video game we play on this channel this year. Um, I think. Because we'll be doing Christmas stuff come... Like, uh, New Year's Eve in that day. So this- I and mean, we'll do a, ch a little bit of Animal Crossing probably Christmas Eve. This is like the last dedicated stream for one. Time flies fast. It does. Send a shout out to Brazil, we love you. <laughs> How's it going, Brazil? Why, the entire population is here. That's incredible. <laughs> Hello from Brazil. <laughs> we are everywhere. Like, sup Brazil? Hope you're doing well over there. Oh, thank you for the hype train as well, folks. Jeez, I haven't even done anything. Like, a bunch of you have subbed and given bits. Thank you very much, guys. Too kind. Today's going to be a fairly laid-back stream, I reckon. I just want to have fun playing this. I've been playing this a lot in my off time. I'm up to... Oh god, how many hours is it? I've got... Okay, it's only 15 hours logged. When do we play with Spiff and them? <laughs> it was like last week Thursday. It's not that bad. I've played it for a few hours every day. Only... That's not that bad. If I said, like, I have 200 hours in this game in the last week, that will be a concern. 15 hours ain't that bad. I'm playing, like, a, like a two hours a day or something like that. Like, that's, that's not terrible. It's good fun. Is that that bad? This is called Denial, Dan. If you's telling me right now that, like, when you discover a new game, like, like, Pokemon just comes out? Oh, sweet! I can't wait to play it! You sit down on the weekend? Okay! It's time to play for 45 minutes, and then I'll put it down for the day. But, is that all of you in chat right now? Like, you're watching me play video games. Most of you are here for, like, hours at a time. Seven stages of grief. Okay, let me take a 45 minute. Let me play for 45 minutes, and then I'll take a 15 minute break to rest my wrist, and then I'll go outside for an hour and eat a salad. No one does that. Don't don't kid yourselves, chat. <laughs> no, more realistic depiction is, I have a new game. I am going to play this for 16 hours straight, fueled with, but with, fueled solely on like takeaway and sugar. <laughs> I was tempted to say Monster Energy, but I wouldn't. I wouldn't recommend that. The outside hurts my eyes. We can't argue with facts, can we? I dare you not use the Pomodoro technique? What the fuck is the Pomodoro technique? <laughs> what does that mean? Is that like in Super Auto Pets? <laughs> I'm a swan main. The 
Pomodoro got me through my masters. Oh, the Pomodoro is literally what I described. Oh, okay. <laughs> right? 45 minutes of work, 15 minutes of rest. You see, that's good in theory, right? But I find that if you do 45 minutes of work, then you take 15 minutes of rest, that those 15 minutes get stretched. It's like 45 minutes of work, six hours playing games, frantic panic for two hours because you realize you haven't worked in it all day, and then you go to bed so you don't have to stress about it as much anymore. Rinse and repeat. <laughs> like, that that's how we get true, like, kind of uni life. <laughs> Stop calling us out like this. No, I mean, honestly, for me working these days, like, I find that if I take a break, um... I, I, I struggle to just get back to it. So like, if I'm sit down and I'm kind of like in the zone, I just stay in that a while. Which is kind of like a blessing and a curse because it means that like, if I have to do something, I will get it done if I start doing it. Um, but if it takes too long to do, it, I, like, oh shit, I forgot to eat today. And I have like days like that where it's like, well, it's six o'clock now. Breakfast was a long time ago. <laughs> Uh. When are you getting married? <laughs> We're talking about like work ethic and that and it's like like strategies. Just all caps tag in chat. When is it? <laughs> Get off my case, mom. My granddad every time I would see him. God like, uh, like God love him. Um, he'd always ask, like, how have you been, and how is the love life? And it didn't, like, no matter what, he would always ask. And it's like, Granddad, no, I don't, I don't want to go into this. <laughs> I'm just happy to see you. <laughs> Savage. <laughs> What's your relationship status? Jesus. You remember that was like a fucking big deal on like Facebook and that? I was like, but you have to declare it! I I've gotten to the age now where I simply don't care about like sharing things like that publicly anymore. <laughs> uh, like who needs to know? Official declaration! Congrats on your engagement. Delete my Facebook already. Yeah, I, I don't I don't use Facebook anymore. Like I have like Messenger still purely to talk to people who are also on Messenger. And just not on Discord. <laughs> but like I remember it was being such a grand official thing. And it's like I do not I d I don't I don't get it. it couldn't be me. I'd be invited to the wedding. <laughs> Oh, God. Okay, uh, we gotta start playing as well. Oh, God, we've gotten into, like, a rabbit hole and a tangent here. My grand flips been telling me I'm stupid to... And then asking, are you courting? Wait, what? Courting? Who says that anymore? Like, you're not- your relationship's not official until you, you cement it on Facebook. I don't know, it's just like the equivalent of me, like... It'd be the equivalent of, like, post- like... That kind of status to me is, like... Getting, like, a giant, like, A2 picture printed. And, like, plastering it... On your front door. <laughs> it just seems so unnecessary. Where's the Drift Queen, Dan? <laughs> oh, God. Just 3,000 people watching you get married with your PC set up and you're streaming. And you're waiting to see a pog champ. 
Let's, let's live stream a wedding. Why not? Okay. Super Auto Pets. I've fallen into the rabbit hole. Well, fa I've fallen down the rabbit hole of this game. I simultaneously hate Spiff and love him for introducing me to this. Uh, this game is just so much fun, and it's what I've been playing in my off time lately. Uh, for today, I just want to play it and get excited and be happy a while. Addiction. Maybe? But damn it, I'm gonna enjoy it, and I'm on quite a high right now. It's not a bad addiction if I just ignore the negative side effects. Let's go. Okay, we're gonna buy a duck. Uh, if you haven't seen this game, just to introduce it. Uh, it's an auto battler. First stat is attack, second stat is health. You kind of like make your team and then they fight other teams. Um, it costs three gold to buy anything. You get ten a turn. It costs one gold to reroll like that. We're gonna get the mosquitoes because they're gonna cause some damage and then we'll get Ducky Boy here for later. Uh, we're gonna be... <laughs> I mean, I feel like these two are inappropriate no matter what I do, but we're gonna be the lush carrots. <laughs> no, I don't like that. The lush carrots. Okay, let's get them, gang. Look at that, we've already won. Fantastic start. The goal is to try and get 10 wins with your team. Oh, we're gonna mosquito gang up here. I'm gonna get an additional duck. I can get another duck right now, but if I wait, if I wait a moment, uh, I think next turn, like, a higher tier of animal is unlocked, so we can get, like, an even higher one. So put the duck on ice. Just get a horse for now. What's the meta then, lads? Like, how, how do we suck, like, all the joy out of this game immediately? <laughs> like, I need to know what, like, the... Like, 60% win rate team is. Oh, God. Okay, we're, we're not off to the best of starts. Actually, no, we, we might be okay here. We got a rabbit. Pet eats shop food, give it one help. We can get another big boy. The snail is actually really good at this point in the game. Uh, what I can do is I can put in the rabbit. And we'll put down the snail. And because I lost the last one, he buffs everything on the team. So... I think only God can stop us now. <laughs> We've become quite powerful quite quickly here. Uh, we'll save a peacock for later. Okay, let's get him gang- like, you've got an elephant. 3-5 with a downside? That's cute. Because we're a snail, we're just killing everything now. We can get another duck. Do I want another duck? Do I need like a tier tree duck? <laughs> what does that accomplish? You know what? Yes we do. And we're gonna give him some meat too. There we go. The Boulder Fist Ogre of Ducks right now. He's gonna hit him quite strong. Just... just buff him. Just buff him. Uh, I don't want the Peacock anymore. I do want... I probably want the Swan though. Okay, the strongest duck. He's gonna take on the world. Oh no. Okay, we might be in a spot. A botter. <laughs> we lost. Okay. Uh, I can... Okay, get rid of the snail. Uh, we have to start getting the swan. We should probably upgrade the swan. I don't know if I want another horse. I, I think we can get better. Well, actually, now we got the sheep. We also have an ox. Uh, 
We probably want the sheepy boy. And the sheepy boy and the ox are actually quite good. Oh, the horse is quite good here too. This duck probably shouldn't be here anymore, but we've already committed. It's too late. I think I have to get rid of you. We get a sheep down, because the sheep and the horse are quite strong together. Um, the rabbit might have to go soon, unfortunately. I think, I think we need the ox. Because if the friend ahead faints, he gets melon armor, so if you put one of these bad boys behind the sheep, then, like, your sheep becomes two sheep, and the ox becomes a god. So, like, I, I think I, I think I need to get rid of the rabbit boy, unfortunately. We gotta keep, we gotta keep the duck. I'm sorry. <laughs> I'm so, what, what, wait, what, what, what should we name him first, real quick? Make this a more emotional. I'm sorry, Flopsy. <laughs> you gotta go. <laughs> Okay, and then we keep the swan for some resources, just to get some extra gold. Oh no, he's already back! Um, uh, we don't- we don't need anything there. Okay, the duck is gonna lead us to victory. I just want to make this guy, like, Boyho as strong as humanly possible. Look at this, he's taken on the world already. Defeated their strongest unit. Now the sheep are here to clean up. He misses you. <laughs> we don't have room on the team for Flopsy, I'm sorry. Uh, keep- keep the horse, I think, because with the sheep combo, it's probably... Is it that good, really? It's two extra attack. Uh, I think we keep it. Here, okay, give- we'll give... the sheep a taste for- for meat. It should make it more powerful. Oh, uh, we're probably gonna keep the swan around, so let's garlic him up. And let's just make the duck even more powerful this round. There we go. Oh, look at him go, he's gonna take them all. He's dead. Oh no. Uh-oh. Oh, the sheep! <laughs> Oh, I think... Damn it. He had a beat. Oh, that's devastating. Okay, I mean, we can get a penguin. We can get the rooster. The kangaroo is good if the ox lasts a while. But for the ox to last a while, I think I need to get rid of the horse. I think maybe I sack the horse. I think we need the kangaroo. There is a penguin here that's very dapper with his top hat. Um, but we've really no space for him on the team right now. I think, I think we need the kangaroo. We have to give that that. Got a whale. Do like some crazy shenanigans with whale eating the sheep. Uh, we need to make the duck stronger. <laughs> Uh, this is good if we get another duck, because they don't passively buff. Oh no, the, no, I, I think the game wants to give us the worm. Uh, we could, we could get a worm. We'd have to s sack the kangaroo next turn, though. The bi- oh, but I kind of want the bison. We're so tight on space. The problem is, that, like, these guys are so cute, we make friends with all the animals, and then we have to sell them off. Because, like, I'm sorry. There's something cooler than you now. I feel like the ox is quite strong right now, but I kind of also want a worm. If I get a big boy worm, then the kangaroo can still, like, kind of play here. The, if I get the bison, I have to get rid of the swan. That to be like bison, kangaroo, worm. Is the sheep really necessary? The sheep might not be necessary, no.
Okay, let's see what we get. We might need to get rid of the sheep. Oh, you bastard! <laughs> Uh, the, she the sheep is all that's kind of protecting us here right now. No, we're so dead. Oh, did we just barely? Somehow it's a draw. Okay. Ox has to go. Bow down to the worm. Uh, we really need a duck. The bison isn't that good until we get the last duck, actually. I think we even unfreeze that, because I think it's quite unlikely that it's going to just give us the duck. Uh, and I think we have to feed the worm a little bit. Okay, well, it gave us the duck now, but we didn't know that was coming. It gave us another worm, too. That's, that's really good. There's the bison back as well. Oh, it's all worked out. Wonderful. Okay, the round after this, we're gonna be in business. Probably not this round. <laughs> oh my god. <laughs> oh, he's a penguin on his team. That's why he's so godly powerful. Okay, we gotta buff the worm. Buff the duck. Uh, if I lose... Like, that's it, as well. I think we we gotta just sack the swan. You think, no, I... Oh, I need power, but no, I, I gotta take the bison. Okay, and then we just, like, roll the dice with sushi. I was really hoping the worm would eat something. God damn it, worm. Yeah, at least the bison will get stronger. Uh, we might die here. Come on. The duck can lead us to victory. Oh, go on, duck. Okay, we have a chance now. We just gotta ramp the team wildly from here. We can't afford to lose anymore. So I'm gonna make it so I get extra gold per turn. Gotta get the kangaroo up. Um, just to probably live the round, I probably want to give the worm maybe the cupcake. Actually, no, if I give- if I give the worm the garlic. If I give him that. Get the bus. We don't have room for the bus. We're one loss away from dying. We can't afford to, like, change course this late in the game. Okay, chocolate is good. Like, we got, we, we, like, we're trying to just barely survive right now. <laughs> you have to understand. There's no time for the bus. Oh my god, he's got a hippo. Oh no. Our friends are dead. May the duck rest in peace. Yeah, let's try it again. Okay. Anti boy. The fish is actually real strong. Um, and we'll get an otter this time. Okay, uh the moody chipmunks. It wouldn't have happened if you had the bus. I would have died faster with the fucking bus. <laughs> oh, this is unfortunate. Okay, we weren't we weren't gonna win that first round anyway, it's fine. Get another fish. Buff him. Oh, that's a lot of fish. <laughs> that's a lot of fish. Okay, I mean we we have to just bring on another fish. We have to keep this fish in the wings. keep them about for now so we have people to fight with. Come on, chipmunks. You can take them. No, 
There we go. Top Hat Otter is leading the team. We're good. Okay, I can... I can now upgrade. Um... Yeah, I guess I just want to do that. We're gonna get a rabbit. It's cool. Uh, we'll take the rabbit. There's another fish! <laughs> How many fish do we need? Yeah, oh, we, we don't even need the freeze that. Yeah, just pop on the fish. Just, <laughs> just... Make him as big as possible. I'll freeze that because I can use it on the ant. We're gonna just make a giant fish. Here we go. You can't beat him. He will destroy you. Okay. Buff the fish. Uh, we can get a, a cheeky sheep here too. And kill that. <laughs> Thanks, Flopsy. You tried. Um, I can get one more. I can get a dodo. If I want to give the fish even more power. Oh, the otter is the otter better if you upgrade it like direct onto him? I think he might be. You get the level 2 effect. Okay, thank you. I didn't actually know that. Uh, we could just get the honey. The honey will actually... Yeah, the honey actually might be kind of good here. There you go. Our strategy is big fish. Let's go. Works every time. We can't beat him. Okay, we can buy another otter. If I pop the otter on here, does it just do the level 2 effect? Yes, it does. That's really good. Oh, that's actually- yeah, that's- that's fantastic. Flopsy's getting more powerful now. Uh, we can take a swan. <laughs> the game really likes giving me fish. This is going to push them over the edge. Oh my god, and there's a worm. Oh, there's a worm and there's a rabbit. Okay, we got to we got to go all in on that next turn. Uh I'll probably have to get rid of like the swan or the sheep. Um probably better to get rid of the sheep, so I think I don't freeze that. Yeah, we keep the swan, so I'm gonna replace the sheep with the worm, and then we just start feeding them. Gotta keep the fish handy a while. Oh, look at the size of this lad! He's just taking out all their heavy hitters! Okay. Gotta get him. We we need a worm. We have to get a worm. Because once we start like once we get him upgraded too and we start getting good food, the worm's just gonna get out of hand so quick. <laughs> Game's still like, do you need another fish? <laughs> we don't have room, he's fully upgraded. Uh, that's pretty good. We, we don't have space for another fish. Like, I have to get rid of, like, the swan or something, but the swan's real fucking good. <laughs> Screw the swan. No, the swan! If <laughs> we don't... We don't have room. There's only room for one fish. Uh, that's kind of good to just slap on the worm soon.
We already have a fish. The otter is technically more powerful than the fish now, too. Oh my god, just the combo of them. They're just mowing through them. The worm is not very powerful right now. Flopsy is also incredibly powerful. Oh, let's make him stronger. <gasps> we got a monkey, we can make the fish bigger. <laughs> oh my god. Oh, this is gonna get real stupid though. This is gonna get so stupid if we just put it all on the fish. Do I get rid of the worm? Do we not even bother with it? Do we just level up the fish? We just... Okay. Alright, the fish has to go. Let's get the monkey. Pop that on the fish. It buffs it. Just, just make it as big as possible for the next round. Oh, this is stupid. <laughs> He's so powerful. Your melon armor is useless. <laughs> My fish is too big. We can get another fishy boy that will eat the other fish. I don't think that helps us though. I don't think that helps us at all. So we shouldn't do that. A bigger fish that eats the other fish and makes it weaker. Like, no, I, I don't think we need that. I mean, I, I just gotta make the fish as big as possible. Uh, the swan is good for some additional resources. Uh, I guess we buff the otter here, too. <laughs> 1724. Oh, did I, did I miss an otter? Oh, my bad, yeah. Look, we don't need it, alright? The fish is doing enough. The fish is doing enough. The otter didn't even have to fight. I can get a bison that will level up as well because the fish is already so big. The pirate will copy the ability from the pet ahead as level 1 until the end of battle. That unfortunately doesn't work with the monkey because that's at the end of the turn. There is a rhino. I, I can get rid of the swan at this point. The swan is the only one that's worth like, considering. Okay, see you later. We'll get another big boy on the team. Uh, we can give something the chili pepper. Oh, the cow is real good though, because that gives um, extra milk, and then if he drinks the milk, he gets even bigger. Oh yeah, I'm sorry, Mr. Bison. Yep. The play has been made. We we need the cow. Because like, he's just getting too powerful. The turkey is usually amazing, but we have no need for it here. Uh, we can sell back the cow. It has served its purpose. Uh, probably, like, getting a hippo? Like, it's the best possible thing here. And then we just give some salad. Oh my god. 23-38. No, he's got a scorpion! <laughs> the fish is doomed! Oh no, and he's got a worm! Oh god damn it, he had a one-shot kill. We didn't stand a chance. Okay, we can get the last otter. Uh, we can get another monkey, we probably do want that. We have a leopard now. Um, oh, we, no, the bison, the bison came back. 
Okay, that'll just be a passive buff then. I think I freeze the pair too, because the pair is quite good. Make the fish bigger. You have a 22 peacock? That's cute. Oh, wait, no. Oh, no, he's killing me. <laughs> no! <laughs> oh, it didn't, what went wrong? Okay, wait, so if I get the snake, right? I think it's time we get rid of the otter. Hear me out. Because the snake is incredible. Okay. We, we use this on him. So the monkey's even more powerful now. Uh, the snake is going to need a little bit more power just to survive. Everything here is kind of rubbish. That's really good. <gasps> There's another cow. Oh, why do you always come at the worst possible times? Every time we try to get this bison off the ground, like, he gets sacked. Every single time we try to get him in. Like, I don't think there's anything, I don't, I, I gotta get the cow in. I need the milk. We gotta make the fish more, like, more powerful. Freeze the cow. Sack Flopsy? Flopsy? But Flopsy's quite good. We need Flopsy. I, I need to get the bison a bit bigger, too. We're gonna leave with the bison. That will, like, protect against any poison. Okay, no, I'm gonna say goodbye to the cow then. I'll keep, I'll keep that steak handy. Keep you handy. It gave me another fish there. <laughs> okay, we gotta spread out some of these stats so we have like a backup plan. Okay. Oh, get going with the snake. Come on. Everything's dead already. Snake is so strong. Okay, I mean, here we just toss that down. Flopsy is gonna come in. Do that. Uh, we can give the snake the steak. So that when the snake has to fight something now, it's actually, like, surprisingly strong. And we just save the chocolate. Do we make the fish bigger? Or do we get the bison up a bit more? I feel- yeah, I feel like the fish isn't big enough yet. There we go. <laughs> 23 peacock? That's cute! Oh, your kangaroo's not buffing. Oh, his fucking snake. There we go. Our snake's gonna take him on. It was a scary team there. The fish has persevered. Uh, we need to give something the chocolate. What's the most valuable thing to get so it keeps buffing higher? Probably the bison? The fish is already level 3, we can't give it the chocolate. It's either the snake or the bison. We need to make one stronger. The monkey, I think, is strong enough. The monkey's doing a good job. Like, the fish is gonna be on maximum health in a moment. Do a roll first. Well, I mean, I, th I think I'm popping that down regardless, because that's just... That's just numbers. Okay, we'll make- we'll get the snake up a bit. 
Keep that. It's just really good numbers. There's another Flopsy. Get the bison even stronger. Oh, look at him go. Okay, the fish is coming in now, though. No. Oh no, the fish! <laughs> we still got it. Flopsy was left. No, we won! We straight up got 10 wins! I've only done that like four times, I think. Like, very, very few. The fish was big enough! Oh, we gotta go fish again then. We gotta go. <laughs> Is this gonna happen again? Uh, the insolent bagels. <laughs> All our games just gonna be use the fish. Like we've cracked the meta. Okay, there's no fish offer in here. Horse is good. Uh, mosquito is good. Uh, we can get our friend... Gain an extra gold or gain that. I uh, get, get, get the pig. And just hit them, like, very strong for whatever comes out first. Here we are, RT, a five fish team. I don't know if that's, like, possible. I need some very lucky, like, rolls to even line up the people for that. Or the animals. Oh, god damn it. No, like we're not we're not getting enough fishy boys here. I'll take I'll take another one of them. Uh I kind of prefer having an otter over the pig. Hey Kim. Uh sure thing. Okay, and we can get I think I just want to save the horse because I can get a level two there. I don't know if I want to like go all in the mosquito or the ant. Uh, known duck, thanks for two forty-five apples. Thank you for a thousand bits earlier. I may have overdrawn my bank account, but I'm gonna have my own cupcake, so it's worth. It. Well, thank you very much for buying the YouTube's man. I appreciate it. Yep. Oh wait, wait, we have a root roll. There we go. The hedgehog. Probably should have used that on him before. That's okay. Let's get him. God almighty, that was a strong team. <laughs> oh no. Okay, give us something good. That's a camel. It's really not what we were lo looking for. But, we'll take it. Uh, we can make the big fish real big with this guy. Uh, we should probably take a swan as well. That means that the otter probably has to go. Actually, wait, no, 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 uh, kill him. There we go. Yeah, we can, we can keep the big fish big. Okay, power him up. He's not strong enough. <laughs> oh my god, we're being destroyed. The fish isn't big enough. He needs more power. Like what? Like this isn't gonna help us. Maybe we have to throw in the peacock real quick and make him real big. After the camel. No, we gotta go in for the big fish. I'm go- I'm going in for the fish. Take a ho I- I can take a horse. I 
fucking... You know what? I'll take the sn I kind of place the snail right now. Oh my god, that's terrible. I'm gonna be eaten alive. Unless I sell one more of those. Oh, what the fuck am I doing? <laughs> Okay, maybe this will work in our favor. Okay, we, we're alive. Choices were made. Okay, camel is gonna need some garlic. Uh, the snail's gotta go. We can't. We can't keep him. Oh, thank God they're here. <laughs> okay. Oh, but the problem is we're still gonna have a team of four now, because if I pop other stuff down... I- because I, I need the kangaroo to get the upgrade, which means that he comes in. Like, what does the whale accomplish here? Okay, we're gonna- we're gonna need more fish. We're going all in. So it's gonna be whale and big fish. But I- I don't know what to use the whale with. I could use him with the melon armor. <laughs> that's- that's a- not a good combo. Oh my god, he's already killed the fish. No! How do we make it through that? How are we alive? So I have no idea what to do with the whale. The whale doesn't even synergize with anything. Yeah, I, I, I don't think we can keep him. We don't have anything for him. In the horse. The horse is a 10-7 and like one of the strongest things on the team. You can get rid of the horse now? You're setting yourself up for failure. I'm gonna have to go all in on the worm. It's the only way. It's the only way. Oh my god, we've lost the fish again. No, I think I, I don't know if we're doing this one. I don't think we can come back. The Uncle Sam team got us. Okay, we ju we just gotta go all in on the worm. It's <sighs> damn it! It didn't land on the worm. Oh, this is- this is like a desperate team. <laughs> no! We already lost the fucking kangaroo! Oh, come on, big fish! Come on, big fish! <laughs> we did it. A second victory. <laughs> okay, we can make the worm bigger. The kangaroo, in theory, is great if the fish lives. Okay, I'm glad I did it that way, because now I can feed the worm. Give the worm some sushi. Should the kangaroo be after the worm at this point? Should we just, like, are we so focused on big fish that, like, we just neglecting that this guy's probably the strongest thing on the team now? We did get a gorilla, too. And a coconut shield. Yeah, I think we I think we I think we're all in on the worm now. And then we have these guys around the worm and then we have some extra space that if we sell some stuff. 
I, 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 don't, I don't think there's room for the gorilla at this point. Oh my god, no! <laughs> We're dead. People keep saying the horse is useless. The horse was one of the strongest things on the team. Like, we just need stats. The horse's effect wasn't great, but we just- it doesn't matter. He's more useful than the fucking fish. Like, sometimes you just gotta take what you can get. Uh, let's just do a tokens team. Sure thing. But, wonderful. Uh... The Witty Hedges. Oh no, his are just stronger. Surprisingly, we got through it. Okay. Buff the other otter. Uh, keep him for the next round. We don't pop him on yet because we don't get as strong of a unit. The same reason we're not upgrading these guys just yet. Uh, I guess we can take a fish. Actually, no, wait, no, the horse is really good here. <laughs> the horse is amazing with these. Because he's gonna, like, buff every single one of them that comes out. And that's gonna get us through. Horse is the worst unit? Well, the worst unit just won us the game there. I don't know what to tell you. Mr. Mustache, thank you for the tier tree. Okay, now we buff him. And we see what we can get. God, we can go all in with the fucking otter. Oh, no, wait, I've done that wrong. I shouldn't have taken that extra otter. Uh... <laughs> Oh no. Flopsy's back. I mean, I guess we take a camel. Do I want Flopsy? I don't think Flopsy's that good here. I'll try it that way with Mr. Otter. Let's go. Easy game, look at that. Okay. Uh, friend sold, give a random friend one help. I don't know if that's worth the cost investment for it. I don't think any of these guys are particularly good. Do I want a hedgehog? I'll always take a swan. Uh, the spider could be good. Because we have the horse again. We do have two swans as well. We could just get, like, a bigger swan. Um, but I'd have to trade the camel, most likely, for that. Can't really afford to trade the otter right now. And the otter. I can't- I can't afford to get rid of him. The otter's a 5-6. He's like the biggest thing on the team. I can't get rid of him at this point. I'd have to get rid of the camel, I think. It's the camel or the horse. Get rid of him. Okay. 
Yeah, we, we have to keep the otter because he's a 5'6", because otherwise we just don't have enough stats. <laughs> like... His ability's not exactly the most useful, but he's he's big. What's going on? He's got a lot of horses. Oh my god. Uh. Yeah, we're fine. Uh, nothing really good here. That's good. A rooster, summon a chick with one health and half the attack of this. Um, that's probably pretty good. I guess we're going all in as like a token kind of deck. Let's go with the horse, yeah. Uh, the question is, what do I sack? I think I, I keep the swan at this point because it's going to give me two gold every turn, which is quite good. The otter may have to go now that we have another 5-3. But I think this one's just more powerful than the otter. There we go. I can update- I can upgrade the cricket, but I probably don't want to keep the cricket around. I think I can get better than that. You know? I think we just ignore the cricket for now. The spider is is like is just like a better version of him. The sheep would be real good. We can we can swap him out for the sheep soon. Okay, let's go. Oh god, he's got a big fish. Okay, we can take him down with the chick. Oh, somehow we just barely take it. That worked remarkably well. Okay, I think it's time to get rid of the cricket. And we bring on another sheep. We have the token gang here. And then Mr. Swan here is just giving us more resources to work with every turn. Maybe. We just kind of need to start popping some stuff down too. Probably want a bee. Got him, rooster. Oh god, we need better spawns from that spider. <laughs> oh, it's... The bee! The bee! <laughs> we just barely were able to take it. Yeah, upgrade the sheep. Uh, I think we give him the pair. Upgrade the rooster. Uh, I can get a bus now. <laughs> there is also a penguin. Uh, question is, what would go if I get ri if I get the bus? The spider's already got a bit of investment. I'd probably have to get rid of the sheep. The sheep is actually particularly good though with the horse. Get rid of the swan, but the, the swan is like our money resource. Like we we actually really need the swan. We need resources. Too bad. <laughs> no, you don't. Um, the horse is going to be good if we actually upgrade it. The penguin does give a more permanent buff, which is something to consider. If I can get- all of them are just one bit away from level 2. I think I keep the penguin. I think maybe we'll switch over.
think maybe we sack the horse. The, there's no room for the deer right now. There's absolutely no space. <laughs> Yeah, we could take on the bus at least. We got the fucking snail. Oh, this is horrendous. <laughs> no. Oh my god. Why not freeze the deer? The, the deer wouldn't be enough. Okay, get rid of the horse. Uh, we get a quick cow. Cause we get some ni lovely milk. Pop that on you. Sell, put in the penguin. Wonderful. Oh, now it summons two. Ooh. Oh my god, we also got a lot of these. There is a peanut scorpion, too. Uh, the scorpion might be better than, like, maybe the sheep or something. Maybe just to get through this bulky first thing. Do I just keep everything? And then we sack the sheep next turn, and then we just upgrade everything else. The pear is honestly quite good, too. I think we gotta move him to the front just so there's room for everything. Okay, all right, we, we, we invest in next turn. We got him, gang. Oh my god, you're kidding me? <laughs> no! Oh, that was an unfortunate one. All right, that's fine. I, could, I mean, I'm going all in on the rooster. Um, yeah, I, I kind of want him. He's just gonna, like, take out something. And we can work on getting the penguin up. Okay, so that means that potentially next turn, there is milk that we could get, but we don't really have space. Penguin's gonna keep buffing these guys. And then we just have a scorpion that's gonna take something out for free. I don't want to freeze the sushi right now. I want, I think I want to like roll for chocolate more. I think that's more important. There we go, a 25 fish. Perfect. Oh, he does have a big crab though. Thankfully, the penguin beats the monkey. <gasps> oh, we got the turkey. Okay, we, we have to take the turkey, because the turkey buffs tokens. Ooh. That means that he, the scorpion probably has to go. People keep saying sell the swan. The swan is great. The swan is amazing! Like, the two gold a turn, right? I, I know it doesn't seem like much, but you get so much more resources just to work with. Swan is like an MVP. Yeah, it has to be this guy that goes. We, we, we have to get the turkey. That's too important. like, why have you left me, papa? <laughs> I think we just roll to try and get, like, either, like, well, the penguin buff more than anything. I'll pick up a bee for the penguin. Turkey. We need one more penguin, and then we can get really far ahead. 
Oh god. <laughs> oh, that actually worked with the turkey. Oh, look at them go. Our birds are putting in work. Okay, this is so important. So he's gonna buff them plus two, plus two each turn now. Uh, the rooster does not have, like, an ability yet. I could just give it the chili. It's tempting. Spider is quite strong. Oh, I could have upgraded the turkey there, couldn't I? I could have got a tier tree. Ah, but the penguin, though, like, the penguin, like, that's a plus 6-6 six, six still. Like, that's permanent. I'll, I'll get another rooster eventually. I can actually do that because the bee will actually help with the turkey. Pop that on. I don't think we have room for the snake or anything. There's some real good ones. Oh, that guy's too good with the turkey. I think I have to get rid of the swan for it. That guy, that guy is so strong. Yep, we got it. We now it's time to sack the swan. Uh, the fly needs to be quite far back, if possible. Um. It's a bit of an awkward setup because this guy can spawn a sheep sometimes and we're gonna lose a bit. I mean the penguin could go first, but the penguin might just feed into something is my concern. Okay, and we'll just spend the rest on rolls. Oh! Okay, pizza is always amazing. And a fly. Oh no, see this is what I was afraid of. <laughs> oh no! Oh, we gotta get through the camel! Come on, gang! <laughs> no, it's not nearly enough. That's what I was afraid of. Okay, upgrade the turkey. Upgrade the fly. Oh my god, the penguin's gonna buff everything. Okay, alright, we, <laughs> we're cutting it kind of close here. Put that ahead still, because the, the flies are gonna come in and they'll eat into the chicks. Actually, no, because if the flies come in ahead of the rooster, then they'll... The fly will have to fight first. So the rooster still goes before, yeah. Yeah, we're fine. Okay, here we go. We can't afford to lose anymore. Oh fuck, it's another camel. Come on, take him down. Oh, come on, gang. No, the fucking badger! No! <laughs> Why is it always the badger? Ah! Uh, I'm devastated. I hate that badger. Every time it comes up, it just kills us. Alright, it's gonna be a better run already. Because we've got fish. Take a duck. The insolent pencils.
Oh no, he's got a bigger fish. <laughs> we thought. Oh, that was a quick one. Yeah, we can we can go all in now with our fish. Um, we still wait a turn to do it, I believe. Freeze. Okay. That, I mean, that's pretty good there. Come on. We can beat the elephant. There we go. Okay, next tier of animals are unlocked. Um. Oh, how do we want to do this then? I think we, we, we pop them together first. We get some of the other stuff down that we're probably going to keep. Pop down an otter. Oh, I'm probably not going to keep the duck, but... Just upgrade it, sure. Okay, big fish into kangaroo. I can keep that and I can make the ant faint too. Oh no, his fish is bigger! <laughs> oh god damn it. At least we were able to draw. That's unfortunate. Do I just kill the ant now or... I think I wait and see, yeah, because if I get another ant, this effect is now so much better. Uh, and I can get a swan. We get rid of the otter. Swan in. Okay, now it's a big swan that leads the charge. We keep the sheep just for now. Big Swan can take on the world. And we got slightly big, well, smaller kangaroo. That's pretty good. We can get some sheep. Uh, I don't, I don't think I really want to bother with the mosquito. I can get a big fish again. <laughs> uh, sure, why not? We need to get something that starts buffing the swan. We're gonna have trouble as time goes on here. Oh god, the kangaroo's already dead. That peacock did not do anything though, thankfully. Okay, big fish. Pop that on the swan. Start a turn discount to shop food by one gold. Uh, is that really going to be that helpful? Like, maybe? I mean, it's better than the mosquito, so I'll just keep it for now. That's another swan. I maybe should have taken the giraffe, actually, yeah. Giraffe would have been at least some kind of buff, because yeah, they're getting stronger and stronger. Oh, damn it, he just gets the armor back. He's got a massive bunny at the end. Okay, get one of them. Get one of them. Okay. We can do something with these. Uh, that, uh, th these have to be way better, especially the fact that we have a sheep. Let's get a shark. I think the fish has to go. Fish 
fish has to go. Uh, honey could be quite good with the shark and just getting it as big as possible. <laughs> that does seem quite stupid. You can try it. Uh, the swan still leads the charge. I think with the garlic, he, he's going to last longer than the rhino. No, the shark! <laughs> oh, god damn it, that's a terrible start. That was awful. Okay, I can get the rooster back. If I get the rooster back, I think the rhino has to go again. We should probably stick with the kangaroo because uh, it, it has so much power at this point. Or I could do this. That, no, the, sh the shark has to be at the end. I think the rhino's gotta go. We need a rooster. The sheep is terrible. The sheep is a 12 12. <laughs> All right. It also fuels the shark for 6 3. What are you talking about? I've had it up to here with your bullshit. <laughs> Like the kangaroo is a t is a two two, so like we have to just keep that at the moment. It's not ideal here, but like it it's just stats if the swan survives a while. Arguably, it's better to do that because it guarantees the kangaroo gets at least two buffs, which is something the swan has not been able to do lately. Pop some honey down. Oh god. That does give us a buff, but there's nothing to really sell here. Um, I think it's most valuable that we get that up. The swan is here to stay at this point. Okay, let's try this. The kangaroo is going to get at least two buffs here. Which might- which should be enough to carry it a while. It lasted one battle. Okay, the shark is strong though. Come on, shark. Ours is way bigger than his. There we go. Okay, and now we got the turkey. That's wonderful. And we got a monkey. Alright. I still think I need this fellow because he's he's just a level 2. I think the swan, we're gonna have to sack you. There's, there's just no space. There is a monkey as well, but I think the turkey is much more valuable because we have all the token spawners. I think this has to go. Turkey's turkey's just too good. Um I would love to have the monkey on board, but I think it's the monkey or the turkey, and I think the turkey is way better here. Do that just to get a little more shark power. Throw some sushi down. Kind of just want to get some better rolls here. 
We have to commit to the kangaroo at this point because the kangaroo is like... I mean, he, he basically is like a, a 13... Um... 15. So, like, that's just very good. Like, the sheep can go in front of it, arguably. It, it, it doesn't really matter, though. It's just two attacks. Oh no, the rhino! <laughs> oh, the- no, the sheep are okay- no. The sheep are in trouble. At least the shark can finish the job, there we go. We buffed him a bit. Okay, now we start getting some funky abilities. So, level up you. You are- Onto you. Now the turkey is stronger. Pretty good. Uh, the problem is just positioning. <laughs> well, these things summon two. Yeah, but the kangaroo is basically in the front. Buy a tier one pack, give all friends plus one plus one. That no, we we don't have room for that. I would have to sell the shark for this to work, but the shark the shark the shark is gonna be so powerful come the end. I think we have to keep the shark. I think the the problem is the kangaroo, but the kangaroo is also very strong right now. I think we have to just accept that we won't get one of the chicks right now. Kangaroo is useless. The kangaroo is a thirteen fifteen with honey, <laughs> right? If I sell the kangaroo, I die. <laughs> I guarantee you it. A five seven is not that good for round ten. It's not a five ten. It's a thirteen fifteen. With a B. It's one of the strongest things in the team right now. We need to keep it. We lose a chick, but it, it's okay. We need the shark. Like, if we sell the shark, like that's like our end game win. We have to just keep that about, or we're in a lot more trouble. See, now we're doing really good. Kangaroo comes in, cleans up. Okay. Uh, I can... You know, we're going all in. <laughs> we're invested more. I can give a pet an extra life. I mean, that might be handy if the turkey dies. It's better than the bee. Because we do, we do kind of need to keep the turkey. Uh, we can just toss a pair on something here. I think that's the best we can do. Oh god, he's got the flies. You can beat through him, sheep. Look at that, like the kangaroo got up to a 22-26 there. <laughs> kangaroo won us that game. Like, easily. What did they have to, like, resort to anything else? Uh, I think steak is now available, so we should wait for that. Yeah, there's the steak.
We can swap the sheep and the chicken, because it's... Will it be more help? It's 4-4 four, four that become 10-10s. Ten, Those ones will be, like, 5-1s that then become 11-7s. 11-7. Is 11-7 better than a 10-10? Ten, ten? I think a 10-10 ten, ten might be better. Okay. I can keep the sharks safe with that. Uh, steak is just really good just to slap onto something. Uh, we'll put it on the sheep so the sheep just hits even harder. There's another shark. There's another rooster. Oh no, the worm! It's okay, we can take him on. Kangaroo is gonna come in here. Clean up now. Look at that. The thing is, we haven't even had to get to the shark in our build. Like, that's like a, just an insurance policy. <laughs> it's going so well. Oh, the fly is honestly kind of amazing here. Think of how many extra tokens that is. Uh, I'm with the turkey. Uh, it might be time for the kangaroo to go. We still have the same problem with this too much shit at the front. <laughs> turkey for the fly. No, I'm not- the, the, We need the turkey. There's not enough space. The kangaroo I really want to keep alive, because the kangaroo can scale rapidly, and has been winning us a lot of games. I guess maybe I just leave the fly. Maybe there's just no room for him here. The shark is already so good, with all the tokens that are spawn. I think I just keep what I've got, yeah. Uh, we'll just toss a pepper on the rooster. We'll leave with the sheep. Because of the steak attack. There was no room for the fly, sadly. The kangaroo is like lumped in the middle, but he has to stay at this point. Oh no, the melon armor. No, the kangaroo! <laughs> oh, it's a disaster! The fucking snake! No! Oh my god, that snake! That did so much damage! And it's so much to us. I can get a max level kangaroo now or a max level shark. I think a max level shark is what I want. Because he's gonna gain like even more health now. There's no room for a leopard. The kangaroo gets in trouble if it dies immediately, unfortunately. They got sniped that round. Jesus Christ. Uh, Meg, thank you for the 5,500 bits. I've been hit by COVID and these streams are the only thing keeping me going. Thank you, RT. No problem. I hope you're getting plenty of rest. Thank you very much. Very kind of you. <gasps> oh, that with the turkey. Okay, this is dangerous. <clears throat> this is very dangerous. I think I need to have to keep the shark. If I get rid of the kangaroo... Because he gets buffed as well. <laughs> Give him melon armor so he stays alive. Okay, come on. So, th these are going to be some beefy tokens. Let's get them. Oh, but it's only the level 1 abilities that are not as strong as I thought. Oh, come on! The additional turkey! Actually, we're fine. We still have the shark. We still have the shark. Insurance policy. We're still in it.
I think maybe maybe we keep the sheep because they'll have extra help compared to the roosters. There's no there's no we can't like sell anything at this point. A sheep is good. Keep that around. Okay, and we just upgrade something. Um, I have to upgrade that parrot actually, because that's going to be a substantial stat increase. God, it's so dangerous. <laughs> We're just barely making it by here. Oh, this might be it. Buff him. Come on. Okay, that's the first one down. We just gotta get through a 47. <laughs> oh, come on, gang. No. <laughs> we didn't have the right kind of insurance. We couldn't take him. Ah. <sighs> Okay, well, let's go again. Take an otter. Take an ant. Uh... <laughs> the Crispified Rangers. <laughs> oh, I kind of hate that name. <laughs> yeah, their, their build was ungodly powerful there. There wasn't much I could do. Okay, I think we'll win here. Yeah, there we go. Uh, we can upgrade him. Sure, why not? Get one of them and we'll buy a beaver. Sure, why not? It's Christmas. In case you can't tell, I really enjoy playing this game. Uh, like, I... I'm very much into it at this point, and I'm just having a lot of fun with it. I can't believe this game is just free. Uh, uh, that seems kind of crazy to me. But, like, it's it's just so satisfying, and the games are just quick enough. Where I just have a good time. I, I, I think all the animals, they're just like Google default emojis or something, but they're really cute. It's a lot better than Hearthstone Battlegrounds too. I, I honestly prefer it the Hearthstone Battlegrounds, yeah. I think there's just like less bullshit that you have to think about. And it's just like, it's kind of simplified and refined a bit in the fact that there's just five things. And, but there's still these crazy synergy combos and that that you can get that are just really fucking funny. I say, like, it's just funny no matter what with the premise too, because like, like, like Otter Otterton, like just decimates a fish and then bites a swan's head off. You know, like, that's your average match. And that's just wild to me. Oh, no. That couldn't have gone worse. Oh, we're dead. Those are some bad ants. Okay, but we can get... An early turtle. Take it. And sell the beaver. Pick up a spider. Um, that actually probably is very good. I, I think I hold on to that a moment. Because I can just use that on the ant and buff something. The ant's probably not going to make it to the late game. Uh, I can get a hedgehog if I want. Do I want a hedgehog? Hedgehogs can get out of hand real quick. Pill the turtle. You can do that too. I think we keep him as is for the time being though. Okay, you know what? We're gonna we're gonna invest in a hedgehog. And then for the turtle, it makes sense to pop the melon armor on him. Because he's a bulky boy. Well, he's got the most attack. So we'll get like a free one in.
safety. So we can take him now. Oh, the ants just cleaning up. Not the fucking badger again. And we didn't have enough to live because the badger got us. Every time there's a badger. I hate him. I hate him. Nothing good ever comes of it. I'm gonna pill him. I guess the spider's sticking around now. Oh god, these are some... ...kinda rubbish ones. Uh, I'll take... You know what? Sure, I'll take one of them. I really did that wrong. Okay, we might not be punished. Oh no. It's okay, we can still take it. Get him, doggo. Oh, he's just barely gonna live. Okay, we're starting to get rabbits now. Pet eats shop food, give it plus one health. Uh, the fact that there's two rabbits here is kind of leaning me towards taking them. We might just be able to buff, like, real quickly here. Freeze that ammo. Pop those down, yeah. Okay, let's go. Our team isn't really doing anything right now. Oh, they've got a rival, like, meat turtle. Got a fucking badger. Oh my god. <laughs> I hate the badgers. <laughs> they never work in our favor, but you can, can guarantee you they'll work in their favor. Ugh. It sell you away. I think we get an ox. And we can get some quick melon armor with that. Got a rabbit. A penguin? Oh, I mean, we definitely want to keep that, I think. I can get them up real quick. Uh, do I pill the turtle? Because I feel like we're, we're just going to run out of space. I think I'd do that but next round. Next round. We need it for at least one more fight because he's got meat in his system. There we go. He's got to take on that. Hippo ain't going to stop us. Oh, the sheep is actually very nice here. <laughs> Means we're able to buff enough to take them on. The hedgehog finishes up. Another penguin. God, we're getting lucky with the doubles, aren't we? Yeah, the hedgehog has to go. Penguin gang. Uh, I can kill the spider to try get what's inside it, but I don't think that's beneficial here because I want to get to level two faster. I think I just, like, I think I do this on the turtle now. Good meal. And then we get another ox. Perfect. <laughs> okay, so we're just gonna be the buff your friends gang. The penguin's gonna buff everything. I'll keep the pair too, because the rabbit is actually here. Oh god. <laughs> the sheep is good. No, no. <laughs> oh, the fucking badger! <laughs> I hate him! <laughs> I hate him so much! 
I think I I think I just ignore the canned food here. I don't think the three is worth the two one on just a monkey. <laughs> Okay, and then we just buff the spider up a bit. Um, all right, I'm getting a B. I'm getting a B on something because I'm sick of this happening. There you go, Mr. Monkey. The can is a permanent shop up uh, upgrade in the shop as a whole. Yeah, I'm, I'm not planning to swap any of these from here. Like, maybe one or two, it's not worth the gold. God, his sheep are much stronger than ours. Oh, there's only so many we can get through. Oh, come on! We're still in it. There's a lot of sheep. Okay, I can buff either the penguin or the spider. I think I keep that on hold for a moment or two. In case I then roll one of them, like so. If I get that in, it's plus two to everything there. If I get that one, then it's plus six to this one in particular. Is it better to have the average or just all on one? Mm. I think it's the fact that this is melon armor that makes this one better. I think it's the fact that the melon armor is here, because now that melon armor goes a lot further. Oh, I had one more reroll that left. I could have, I could have used that first. Oh wait, no, I don't. The weird is that a UI thing? Am I hallucinating? Maybe. Okay. Buff him. Oh no! Okay, it's alright though. We can get through it. Okay, we have- we have all the buff guys on our team now. Uh, we can get even more monkey. I think we can invest in monkey. This is so good now because we have the rabbit. Just, we're just buffing everything. <laughs> okay, just to spread it out a bit, give it to him. Everything's getting numbers. The fucking badger. Don't do it. Swear to god. Oh no! Wait, the melon armor saves you from the scorpion. Oh. I guess he goes he didn't deal damage. I thought that was it. Okay. I mean, I could do some fancy stuff with a snake in that, but I think at this point we're going all in with the numbers. I think the penguin's quite valuable. I think we just keep him about. Uh, the friend ahead repeats their ability in battle as if they were level one. I mean, uh, it's nothing that really helps with, honestly. The snake and the tiger together are great, but at this point... That means we have to sack everything, and we only have one health. We can't afford to lose the game. We can't afford to lose the game at this point. Um, I think I can pop the melon armor on something. Uh, we'll give it. We'll give it to the bunny here. There's some chocolate. There we go. We just keep good food from here. We need numbers. <laughs> Just gotta feed the team the victory. 
Oh, the spider is just gonna clean up here. And the ox is ready. Uh, this is this is actually amazing now. Everything's just going up. Uh, I'm almost tempted to try let the monkey buff something else. It's dangerous though. I could try get buff the rabbit a bit. No, you know it's more valuable to just keep putting on the spider. Okay, feed that. Uh, I think I keep the chocolate a moment here in case I get the other monkey. Actually, no, you know, I think I just use the chocolate. More chances for more chocolate. I think I just buffed the penguin with it. Let's go. The sooner we get him up, the better. Uh, toss down the salad. The cow is good, but there's no room for it. Okay, melon armor will protect us. You have no power here now. <laughs> oh my god. My team is just so strong. I, I can give the penguins some steak as like a surprise late game thing. Sure, you know, we might as well do something. We might as well do something. Another chocolate. Okay, that's gonna be a 50-50 spider now. <laughs> it's as strong as he can go. Oh god, he's got a bulky team though. Oh, we gotta get through a lot of them. The spider's being chipped away at. <laughs> He's doing his best. There's too many. He's got it. Okay, uh, we could put the rabbit in front now as well. Now we start buffing him a bit. The final penguin. Wonderful. That's gonna give him all three three. <laughs> oh my god. Okay, buff the rabbit. Oh no, the rabbit being in the front there is gonna take a bit more damage. It's okay. Spider is still unbelievably strong. <laughs> We're one win off. Off, come on. We can bring it back. Upgrade the monkey. It's a 9-9 nine, nine to the rabbit. <laughs> Upgrade him. Oh my god, so at the end of the turn, he's gonna gain plus 12, plus 12. <laughs> oh my god, that's so powerful. This is the last fight. This is it. Come on, gang, you've come so far. Oh, it's a hippo. I, I think we've got it, though. I don't think they could compete with the amount of numbers we have. <laughs> Ten wins! Oh my god, that was a stupid game. They got so powerful. This fucking spider. <laughs> like, we don't need this many buff and support units. Like, there's three of them on the team. It's absolutely crazy. Um, I can change the pets too. I do actually own the DLC. The DLC gives you just a different roster of pets. There's like some different ones. Like, here's a bat. Here's the ladybug. 
You get the blue bird. Um, I can try that. I kind of want to go one more with the standard pack first. I'll do one more, and then I'll switch, okay? I'll be streaming till about half eight today. So we'll, ju we'll just, like, we'll go to the end of this hour. So why not? The jovial pa <laughs> Oh no. <laughs> Let's get him. What is their positioning? I lost. I'm just upset with the way they laid out their, their things there. I, I'm just going to be one sec as well. I have to check on something real quick. I'll be right back. Hang on one more. I'm back. Fodder is no more. <laughs> oh, God. It's okay. I'm still here. Uh, you know what? Let's just live a little dangerously. I should have rerolled first to kind of get that horse. Uh, let's pop down a fish. This means that next round, if we get, like, one of these two... We can just get like two like kind of stronger pets immediately. Let's try it. Come on, unwashed pants. You're powerful. Oh, we're gonna draw here. Okay, so here's our otter. This will give us a blowfish. Uh, we can get a double hedgehog if we want, too. I've never found the hedgehog, like, too useful. Most games that I have bring him in, he just gets us all killed. But I could do a hedgehog blowfish combo. There is, like, an odd synergy there. Okay, see, so I can get rid of Mr. Otter. Hang on. Because that'll give me enough for them. I think I do something like this. And hopefully the stat buff falls on one of them. Okay, get him, Hedgehog! Oh, that was actually amazing. Oh my god! <laughs> okay, yeah, that's the combo we're building this round. We have to. That was so good. Uh, I can... I can pop a pill on this. I think I do just to make some room. Uh, we can pick up a swan. Swan is always good. Another hedgehog. Freeze that in case we lose. Okay, so that's just going to weaken everything then. We just kind of keep the swan at the end. Uh, let's go. Isn't that turtle one an emoji? They're all emojis, apparently. Oh, oh, oh. oh no, the sheep! No, oh, I thought we just instantly won it. Okay, well, this, this is what the snail is for. This is what the snail's for. There we go. Sell off the snail again. Take a fish. Big fish is back. We'll love it. Um, there's a turtle and there's also a pill.
I can't afford to do it this round. Oh, the camel. The camel lends into the combo real well, doesn't he? I should have maybe done the turtle thing first. Because now we are in a spot of bother where we can't get the melon armor on the hedgehog. Camel, hedgehog, blowfish. So when it, these guys are hurt, they're going to do more. Kill the hedgehog. Well, th that's not going to do much for us, no. <laughs> um... I can if I sell the big fish, I could get melon armor, but I think that we keep the big fish right now. Especially because he's close to upgrade. Yeah, I think we just ignore the turtle for now. Okay, here we go. Oh no! <laughs> oh, big fish came in clutch. Yeah, there's nothing really there that we want. Uh, garlic on these two is quite valuable. Here is a swan. Do some rolls here. Uh, I want to keep that. I want to keep you. We can make it so that these guys go first. We can just lead with the big fish. <laughs> Okay, big fish. Oh, big fish is actually gonna do do great here. <laughs> oh god, we barely even need the hedgehog. Big fish is just the winning strategy still. <laughs> oh, there's a penguin as well. I don't know if I can fit in a penguin at this point though. The penguin will get out of hand later. Uh, we pop that on that as well. It's just good if that takes less damage. I think we ignore the penguin for now. It feels like heresy, but... It doesn't really work well with ending here. <gasps> oh, we're in business. Oh... <laughs> God, the gang's trying to come back together. The penguin's here, too. I can save the cat and the buff the monkey as well. I don't know if I want to, though. This is a slight buff. I, I might swap a few things out eventually. Come on, big fish. Oh, no, he's got horses. Okay, get him! <laughs> oh my god! The little combo at the end is like surprisingly strong. I'm so sad because Big Fish is just like one off. I, I think I roll first to see if I can level up one of them. I can just get a pair, though. Yeah, I, I think we give up on the big fish dream. I think we give up on the dream. I could have done one more roll there. It's okay. Uh, what order do I do this in now? Do I just buff the camel a lot, because then he'll buff that? No, I think I, I gotta buff the hedgehog, don't I? What way do we do it?
Hedgehog's actually gonna hurt our team a lot. Yeah, he's actually gonna kill people like that. The monkey weirdly needs to go in front. The monkey's got to go out before, but the monkey might also just feed their team and make them stronger, because if they have, like, a hippo, then the monkey's just a snack, you know? That's what I'm concerned about there. Do I just go for, like, an attack swan? I think we just truck out an attack swan. The, oh, the camel is real good too, because if the camel just gets on that. I, I think the camel in the front is probably the best thing, yeah. And then the, the monkey's got to go before them. Okay. Buff the camel. I'm worried the monkey's gonna feed someone, but at least with this it kind of works. We're gonna go all in on that camel. I'm gonna keep buffing him. Oh no, no, it's not gone well. Fucking badger. Okay, we get that up. Uh, yeah, the hedgehog does need to go in front because like he just like triggers everything. I guess if the monkey just dies, it's better if the monkey dies to one of my things than theirs, honestly. Oh, but this means the monkey's gonna buff the hedgehog. Uh, throw down the pair. I think the 2 2 on him is just better. I need the camel to be big. I I I have to buff the cat. Uh, but I I no, the hedgehog has to be big. Okay, that's the order. We have to keep it that way. We have to keep it that way. The cow is so good, but I I I lose the swan if I get it. I can get a second hedgehog. <laughs> get rid of the monkey. The, the monkey? What are you talking about? The monkey is amazing. A second hedgehog would be really good, because then I could just, like, fire spray everything down. Alright, you know what? Okay, I'll this. Breaking all the rules right now. Okay, uh, we'll keep Berta around for the time being. Go, Hedgehog! Okay, the monkeys have been defeated. <laughs> Alright. Okay, get rid of the cow. Uh, we're gonna get a second hedgehog. But like, independent of the first hedgehog. <laughs> turkey is amazing, but there's no room for a turkey here. Gotta be real careful, like, kinda dragging these guys too. can do some funky stuff with the different hedgehogs here now as well. I can get that hedgehog real buff. 
if I want. Let's try it. Keep that. Buy some more food. Okay, double hedgehog combo. Okay, most of his animal friends are dead already now. Except the one that really... We got it. Oh my god, that worked. I didn't think it would. I thought I was screwed. I thought I already lost. Okay, I, I gotta get that camel up. I gotta buff this hedgehog. Oh. Monkey, melon armor so good. Just freeze it all. <laughs> what a stop in all my assets. Okay, uh, what is going on with this team? Oh no. I think they might be having a bad day. They don't seem to have too much at this point. There's another hedgehog. Additional level 2 hedgehog. Strong monkey. It does mean the monkey is going to die no matter what we do now. <laughs> That's okay. The cat is really good, but th there's almost, there's like no room for it. Like maybe if I get some intense food items next round, I sell the monkey for it. But That's like the only trade I could do. Unless I want to combine the hedgehogs. I can melon the monkey to keep it alive. <laughs> Uh, give a pet an extra life. That might be surprisingly good on a hedgehog. That's more hedgehog. Oh my god. Oh, he's got a hippo! Oh! <laughs> okay, get him, hedgehog. Oh, it's not gonna be enough. <laughs> They really want me to run rabbits. Okay, we can get an additional hedgehog. Uh, I have to put the melon armor on something. I think the pufferfish is gonna die with all the hedgehogs now as well. Yeah, he needs he needs to go up one. What's the point in the double hedgehog? Like the double hedgehog is killing everything I own. <laughs> it's too much. At least the, the, actually the garlic will keep him alive. Combine the hedgehogs and get a cat. Uh, I mean, uh, I kind of need the hedgehogs. Like, they're, too, they're... It was so he a team so heavily lopsided at this point. We can't afford to lose a hedgehog at this point. I just lead with the hedgehogs. <laughs> and then we just have this backup plan. Oh, wait, wait, hang on. I got one idea that I can do. I can give the first hedgehog the melon armor. I think that's as good as we can get it. Then, I don't know, in case the monkey survives it. No, I think I think we just take the rolls. We have to assume we're gonna win. I don't think there's room for the cat. A pair is good. Ugh. 
Oh god. Oh my god, he's got a 50-50. <laughs> no. We didn't stand a chance. He got a monkey. There's no way we're going to beat the bison. Okay. All right, here. We're going to we're going to switch. Activate the puppy. So, now we get new ones. So, if the beetle eats shop food, it gives pets plus shop pets plus 1 health. Just, we'll just stock up on everything here. We also get the bluebird. Give the leftmost friend, uh, one attack. That, like, works backwards on your board. Buy food against plus one, plus one. Yeah, let's go. Gonna be the soft swimmers. <laughs> I mean, this one, this is pretty straightforward first round. He, he bought honey. No way we're losing that. Uh, I can get some ladybugs. And I can just buy some food. Let's just do that, sure. Oh, yeah, we can we can take on the fish gang. Behold the bee. Just enough to draw it. Okay. Uh we want to level up these. Uh which way should I drag these? This is a 1-4, this is a 2-4. So that'd be a 3-5, that'd be a 2-5. So, yeah, 3-5. There we go. Oh, we got a dog! The dog, if you get it early enough, is quite good, because this basically, like, every time something is summoned, it will gain more health and attack. So the dog can get out of hand real quick. I don't know if I want an ant. I'll take a swan. The dog with the spider is going to be... That'll be some additional summons with it, wouldn't it? Oh, but I kind of want a swan. Yeah, we're going to need to summon a lot of stuff. Yep. Yeah, I should probably keep him at the end. Uh, we'll just go heavy hitters for the time being. There's nothing that spawns anything. We could get a spider. See what else we get, though. Get him, gang! Okay, our bees fight off and we get a draw. <laughs> That's fine. Yeah, so having, having the extra gold is honestly gonna be handy. Uh, that's only for the current roster of shop pets, too. Ladybug is just a good tank for the time being. Uh, I need to make some kind of changes. Dog will get something off the bee there. It's gonna be a very lopsided dog. From the looks of it. Sure? Do we want to really buff Ladybug? This isn't helping the dog too much. But I think we want to buff it. We can have a level 3 Ladybug for some ungodly reason. Uh, I can get a free level 2 there and just get something that's better for me. I can use the pill then on the spider and get something new out of it.
Oh, good God. Oh, that'd be okay. What is positioning? <laughs> Okay, new levels. We get a llama. If you have four or less pets, gain plus two attack and health. Oh my god, that's wild. Okay, and what do we get for the ladybug max out? Friend summoned, give it plus two and plus two health when not in battle. Oh, so that's just when you buy something, is it? I don't know if I can use either of these. Um, I can use it- I can get the lobster activate it. I think I sell the dog. I think the dog dream is just not happening. <laughs> like... Everything else is just but yeah. Get, get, get him gone. The dog's not happening. <laughs> I don't want him. I can get the llama activated instead if I have four or less. <laughs> oh, that's such an odd, like, one. Well, like, our team is going to be hampered by that. The lobster will give a new friend plus two, plus two. If it's not in battle. Do I take a llama and try make this thing work? Like, if I take the llama, I have to sell the spider. <laughs> Which seems, like, absolutely terrible. <laughs> yeah, plus two plus two is not worth the spot of a pet. Just buy a lobster for now. Let's just pick up a lobster. Yeah, we'll keep that pill handy one more turn. I can use it on the spider. I probably should have froze that snail because I think I might lose. Oh, we're getting so lucky with these sheep. <laughs> okay, puppy. If you have three or more gold, gain plus two and plus two. I mean, that's more realistic than the, the llama was. But I don't know if that's any good. Because if you have three gold, then you could just buy something. It's the equivalent of buying a pair. And I guess, I suppose you can upgrade it. If I pop it down now as well, thanks to the lobster, it'll actually get a slight power boost. With the swan, the puppy's actually very good, isn't it? Okay, well, first things first. We got a bunny. I think I sell the beetle. I, I, I don't think that's gonna do anything for us. She, I mean, the beetle's probably better than this fucking bunny. <laughs> uh, we, 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 can, we can get use out of the bunny this turn. Here. Pop that on. Sell. Puppy. Buff him. You get a caterpillar. Start a turn game one experience. This guy's kind of weird. It's like he transforms into a thing that will copy your strongest unit. That actually might be very good considering we do have quite a strong unit here. Ooh. It will take a while. If you sell the owl as well, that's just a buff. Yeah, I think the butterfly is actually good because we have this, like, powerful ladybug. Uh, and I think we have to get rid of the rabbit for now. Get the lobster buff off. Okay, and now I can't do anything else because the puppy needs to power up. There we go. Okay, so we just have a very strong ladybug. <laughs> 
That is the bulk of our team. I mean, it's working quite spectacularly. <laughs> Jesus Christ! Give plus five and plus five to a friend ahead until the end of the battle. If I pop that on the ladybug... It might be kinda good. But this is- this is literally putting all our eggs in one basket. Yeah, I think the chick is better than the lobster. Um, and I think we have to, we have to invest in this more. There is a worm, but I think it's too late for the worm dream. I think we have to go ladybug caterpillar, and then we just need some resources for the puppy and the other one. But this is like the the free space that we have. Uh, we just keep rolling. Happy cat eats shop food, give friends plus one attack until the end. End the turn, give adjacent friends one health. Okay, we keep another chick. We can get a bus, but I don't think the bus- uh, like, There's no room for the bus at this point. I think we have like a vague idea of what we have to do here. The ladybug is just gonna carry us a while. Oh my god. But the moment it goes, we're in a lot of trouble. We just barely won that. Oh, we are gonna get free stuff because the caterpillar levels up too. Now we have a free rhino. If you buy food, that gains plus three, plus three until the end of battle. So we want to always make sure we're buying some food now, I think. Pop the chick down. I think we just do that because, again, the caterpillar will become whatever the highest stat is. Is there room for a rhino? I don't think there is. Like, the puppy would have to go. We'd have to ditch the puppy. I have to keep the caterpillar. I have to keep the, the chick right now. The swan would have to go. I don't- uh, the swan is, like, allowing us a lot more flexibility with the puppy. But the swan is kind of important. Especially if we can find another swan. Like, I think that- yeah, if you find another swan, that's way better than the rhino. I think we just sack the rhino for now. I don't think we have room. Keep that for later. Good food. Oh my god. <laughs> What's the end turn effect if you get another hatchling chick? It's plus two, plus two permanently. Ooh, I... Do I want that now? I think I want that now. And I think that's worth it over the puppy thing because it just frees up a slot here. You want a rhino? You sure you don't want to take one? Um, we don't have room for the rhino. <laughs> okay, yeah, that's pretty good. So we're going all in with this ladybug. We're doomed. <laughs> the ladybug has fallen. <laughs> Oh, we finally got another puppy. I've been hoping we'd find more of them. There is a cow here. Uh, I think we have to sack the swan. I like having the swan, but I, I, we kind of want that milk. Yeah. There we go. He's gonna buff on up. It's 
stack more of that. Upgrade you. The Drome Dairy. Start a turn, give shop pets plus one, plus one. The expan some of the expansion ones are very weird. <laughs> I like a few of them, but it's like you have to like take like a different set when you use them. Kind of mad. But we just need to get our butterfly soon and we're in business. We can sell the cow, but I, I think I'll just keep it for now. Upgrade the puppy. The food doesn't have to be put in the ladybug. Oh, I know. I'm putting it on it, though, because the butterfly will transform into your strongest thing. And our ladybug is already quite powerful. So if we keep stacking it... We can just finish it now if we want. Friend bot gain one gold. I mean, it's going to gain the experience anyway, so maybe we just don't. I'm not, I'm not, like, it's not urgent that I buy that right now. I might be able to get something better. Well, actually, if I get it now, then I have an extra 16, I, I have an extra very powerful thing, don't I? I might want it for the next battle, honestly. Yeah. I think I want it now. Oh god, the microbe. Faint make all pets weak. They take extra damage. Uh, the seal? Could be a good compliment to the ladybug. So we could just go like seal strat, ladybug, and caterpillar. The seal could compliment them quite well. I can sell the cow. I have to feed the ladybug this turn. The cow- looks like the, uh... Old Bertha here is gonna see one more battle before she retires. Um... The seal could be good. I think I freeze it for now. Gotta make the puppy stronger. Okay, so now the butterfly is going to happen. This is going to be really good. 23, 28. Instantly. Bertha takes some blood in the final out. And see you later, Bertha. Okay, uh, given the chick, the stake attack is probably best. So it actually does something. Because now it'll hit for 24 damage for <laughs> no reason, really. I think outside of that, I just put slap down a seal. Poodle, give one... And one to one pet of each tier. Eh, this doesn't seem too good. Eh. Yeah, you want to upgrade them. There's a boar. Boar is always pretty good. Gotta keep the puppy. We've invested a lot in this fellow. I lead with a surprise hatchling chick attack. Oh, actually, no, because then he doesn't buff anything. <laughs> Never mind. Puppy really needs an upgrade. Yeah, he does. Like, like it's, he's just missing one. If I get rid of the puppy and I just replace him with a boar at this point, it might just be better. Because it's it's costing three gold a turn to upgrade him. Okay, I won't. I won't. There's outrage. I could get an eagle. That's a pretty cool. One. Would the eagle be better than the seal? Okay, I mean, 
If we have the puppy and the seal doesn't really work, it doesn't make sense. I think we go more in the shop front. I think the shop front is better. Which means that we should probably get rid of the puppy. Honestly. I'm gonna debate that for the next turn. Okay, buff him. Butterfly cleans up. You've already invested a lot in the puppy, though. Okay, all right, I'll give the puppy a chance now. Because it we finally got the chocolate it needs. You get to prove yourself now, puppy. Melon armor, we absolutely want. I need to actually start feeding that seal, too. Dogs can't eat chocolate. Look! <laughs> Sacrifices have to be made. We have to do something. It's Coco free. <laughs> if current and future shot pets plus one plus one. It is the bat. Make an enemy weak. Okay, upgrade the puppy. We have to get, like, the seal something to, like, actually take advantage of it. I think I actually just buy the other seal for now. Alright. This is gonna be the team, then, that we go for. Puppy's getting strong. Take on the ladybug. Oh, they've got a worm! <laughs> okay, surprise worm at the end there did us in, so maybe the seal should go at the end. I think I do that. Because now he's gonna start buffing a lot of people every time he eats shop food. I think I give the puppy just one thing of melon armor. Give a pet an extra life, I... yeah, I mean, I, I might as well pop that on the seal next round. We gotta get stronger. Okay, the scary one's the bison. Oh, it didn't even stand a chance. Bite menacing chicks at the end, but we're okay. Okay, we're one off. We might be able to win it. Beat the seal. There's no point in feeding this because it loses its buff after it transforms. Pizza is so good right now. If it hits the seal. <laughs> oh, here's the better puppy. Give all friends two one. Uh, it's a bit late to sell the puppy for a T-Rex. It's a bit late in the game to be doing that. The cow is real good, but there's nothing worth selling. Yeah, we've already got all in. Come on! Oh, this is a scary looking team. Come on, we can take them! Ten wins again?! I think this is the best I've ever done playing this game. And I happen to be streaming it. Like, I fail so much more often when I'm not streaming this. Honestly. I've got, I, I, have I gotten three of those today? I think I have. We can get another ladybug if we want. Oh no, do we do it again? <laughs> I mean, the ladybug is actually quite good at this point in the game. It's just... My team is I buff the ladybug. <laughs> That's it. That's the game plan. <laughs> I'm 
So sorry. Okay, we got it with the B. Take another ant. Do a roll. Uh, give the leftmost friend the attack. So we'll just pop down a bird to buff him more. Oh my god! <laughs> the fucking fire in line here. Oh no. Oh, we're in trouble. They've got artillery. <laughs> yeah, they do. Ah, oh, damn it. We didn't get uh, enough for a level 3. Upgrade the ant. Uh, start a battle, make an enemy weak. Give shot pets plus one plus one. That's honestly quite good because we're going to be changing our lineup anyway. Let's just do that for now. Probably should have moved that ant. Oh, I absolutely should have moved that ant. Oh. Well, that's my fault there. I was hoping to get a different shot pet. But, alright, I mean, this will give me a, at a higher level. Hatchlin chick. Fell off the bluebird. He's just gonna take on the world, I guess. <laughs> How many drone dairies am I gonna get? <laughs> Do I keep him? Yes, at this point. Oh no, he's weak. Oh! <laughs> yeah, we win it with a B. Um, if I get the drone and the dog together... That's an interesting combo. I could just cycle shot pets a while. Oh, Friesen makes that stack, does it? Oh yeah, this is even stronger now. Okay, well, hang on. I so it's the start of the turn. I think I get rid of the fish. <laughs> I just make it so we're like camel squad. Is a dromedary a camel? It looks like a camel. Be a bit different. Do we go for the dog dream? I think we go for the dog dream. We're just gonna, like, cycle these animals. <laughs> it's not a great start, is it? If I'm selling them, I could get a shrimp. But I, ha I have to combine him. I don't think I have the space physically on the team to keep them separate. Let's get a qu cheeky shrimp for now. Keep you handy, because we're probably going to lose this next one. <laughs> you know, if we're going to lose it, let's get the super snails next round. Perfect. Okay, everything is stronger now. Alright, so I, ha I have to sell that off. 
Uh, I want to keep this guy around. Okay, so now we just... It's the super snail type. So when I buy him, I get health. And then when I sell him, I get even more health. We now have a 10-10 dog. <laughs> That's a pretty good outcome. And now we just kind of pick stuff up that we're then going to sell again. I should have really got the pig. Freeze him for next round. He's actually very good now. Because it, considering I'm going to be selling and then buying again, he's an extra bit of gold. I don't know if the camel is too good, but the camel's also quite big. We gotta keep him. Oh, he's just gonna tear through him here. <laughs> Go, camel! I'm sorry, I doubt at you. Oh my god. Okay. Sell. Camel. Merge, get the pig, sell, when you sell this, it also gives more, so you buy it, you sell it. <laughs> oh my god, I can't believe this is working. I don't keep the snail because I'm going to win the next one. Um, the sheep is potentially very good because it'll give me more stuff to sell, but I also need that dog upgrade it. Buy a dog. Merge dog. I think I keep the sheep. I keep the sheep because if I get a pill for the sheep, then I can, that means I can sell more of them. Okay, buff the camel. Oh. And dog cleans up. We have the dog dream. There's a puppy now as well. I don't think we can support the dog and the puppy simultaneously. <laughs> I think you pick one of them. Um, it, it It's not possible to maintain them both. Uh, I mean, I could just do some, like, selling shenanigans here. And try get a bunch, but I could also re-roll and maybe get something better. I think I roll first. I mean, that is potentially very good with the sheep then, isn't it? It does mean I have to sell the shrimp though. I think the shrimp would have to go. We kind of need the chicken, the camel, to like fight the world. That defeats the whole purpose of selling. Yeah, it, we're just unfortunately tight on space. Like, like, so getting the two, because what I was thinking is if I use the pill on this, I get two sheep and then I can sell them. It also buffs the dog by two. Like, I mean, th this will give me one extra. I think I can only do it for one then. If I keep, if I want to keep the shrimp, I have to do it this way. It'd be nice if we could upgrade the shrimp. Uh, and I think here we just it's gonna excel keep the snail just in case it goes wrong snails real good to sell 
Uh, put down a pig. We get more for selling them. So we're just buying and selling constantly. At this point, I think we buffed the dog as well. I think he's strong enough. Freeze the pair. I, I think buying and selling them is what we want to do. We really want to get another dog. I'm, amazed, I'm kind of shocked we haven't. I think maybe we still actually leave with attack camel and we have the dog here because it just... Basically, the people said to have strong ends and beginnings. So if we put everything at the, at the beginning, then we're going to suffer at the end. Keep the dog in the wings. There we go. Come on. Oh! He's good. Okay, I mean, these guys are significantly more powerful now. We're still not getting... <laughs> like, level two of these, which is really unfortunate. I could get a mean rhino going. The rhino with the chick might actually be, like, significantly better than the camel. And I think maybe it's time to s consider setting that up. I don't think the shrimp is sustainable anymore. With the buying and selling. I think we- I think we need to commit more to actually keeping stuff about. I think we pop that on the rhino, too. Billy Rhino. I think it is time for the shrimp to, to say farewell. I don't think it's sustainable enough and it's not a, it's not powerful enough. As we move further on, it's gonna like kinda hamper us, I think. I I really wish I could get a dog. Oh my god. Keep the shrimp just for the end, because that might be a good one. Isn't that a rhino? Okay, keep that rhino about. And then, yeah, he, he's got to go next turn because like, it, it, it's just not good enough anymore. Got the rhino support. With, with the chili, this could be, like, really powerful. Oh, no. <laughs> Yeah, the shrimp's- the shrimp's not doing enough. Shrimp's not doing enough. You gotta go, bud. Unknown error happened with error code 401. It didn't like that. Oh, give me the bloody dog, please. I'm amazed I don't have it at this point. I think I might need to take the eagle. Um, I can get... No, I just, yeah, just pop down an eagle. Pop that on the rhino. Yeah, we 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 might die here, unfortunately. <laughs> Not looking great. I can't believe we haven't got another dog and we've been able to get it this big. Oh, this is mean. <laughs> oh. Sick it in the watch. Oh, now you give me the shrimp. After all this time. Oh 
Um, I could get a leopard. Is a leopard better than an eagle? It very well might be. Yeah, I, I think we invest in it. Uh, we also just need some survivability. So I'm gonna just say that... There you go, dog. Give me another dog, please. Thank you. <laughs> Where were you? We've needed you so long. We got you to 2024. Oh, I mean... Oh, that might have been good, but yeah, the, the melon armor kicked in. Oh, we're in trouble. <laughs> we're not quite dead. Okay. Um, is it better for me to put the dog down first or just put the dog straight on the dog? Do I have to sell this leopard as well? Kill the drop. Yeah, that probably should go at this point. Cow might need to go. I can I can get the leopard fully leveled up. Actually, yeah, all my money for this turn is actually spent. Yeah, so just Yeah, just dog. It really wants me to level up the leopard. Buy food, gain a gold. Works three times per turn. I mean, that might be kind of good. Because we're getting to the point where we just want to invest in food. Um, if I sell the drone, the, the, the camel now... The question is, if I do this now, am I going to have enough firepower to make it through? <laughs> I think I have to get it now if I'm going to do it. Pop them there. We're going to have to get melon armor for you too. There's another one of them. Okay, so th we can't level up the dog too much more with like summoning things. The dog really didn't work out the way we wanted it to. Uh, that's good food to buy too. Oh, no. <laughs> well, it's been a good run, boys. <laughs> we just needed the dog to show up so much sooner. Like, where were you? He had, a, he had like, a god-tier worm and, like, the butterfly. We didn't stand a chance. Pick up a pig. Pick up another pig. Sure, go on. Go with the clumsy bagels. Take on the world with them. See? Look at them go. Thank God the drop worked out where it did. Give us an ant. Uh, give us a fish. And get another pig. So why not? Dog was running through the neighborhood. Like, just if we got him sooner, we would have been able to do so much better there. Like, we were waiting half the game for him to get a stronger ability. And just, like, the stat increase is just tapered off after a while. It was a real shame. Oh, I've been hurt once before. <laughs> I don't know about this. 
Uh. All right, dog. I'm trusting you. I'm trusting you on this. Um, I think we can sell the pig too. You know, I don't think we need to sell the pig right now. Uh, I can a transfer these ants' abilities. I can make sure they're on the fucking dog if I want. <laughs> I could sell the pig and sell the fish and just put it all on the dog. Sell off the pig. Okay, here we go. You're fucking kidding me. Ah. <laughs> <sighs> All right, I just give me three friends. Go. Buff the dog. Okay, get him, cats. Okay, it's a draw. That's fine. I can get a stronger cat if I so choose. You know what? Sure, why not? Do one roll here. That's pretty good. In this house, we have a dog. Let's go. I mean, this this guy's gonna carry us for a little while here. That makes him quite strong. Just another dog. We just need to get the other dogs. Like, that's the main thing now. Do I hard roll for a dog? <laughs> I mean, I, 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 think, I think we pick up a swan. I think that's good. Spider there makes a bit more sense. If this eats shop food, it gives friends plus two attack until the end of battle. Um, I mean, I might as well give it something. Because that basically means I'll win the next fight at this stage. Yeah, that's pretty good. Okay, uh... Well, there's... <laughs> I guess we're gonna buff the dog by one means, at least. <laughs> we will get our dog stronger. I think we do keep the swan for the time being. Dog! I need you. Okay, let's go. Get him, spider. Oh, if we actually positioned that properly, he could have killed that too. That's okay. The win would it be? That eats shop food, that will be quite good. Okay, dog has to go on. Uh, I should be doing this in a different way too, I just realized. I, I need... I have to keep the tabby cat for now, because the tabby cat's just going to sustain us. If anything has to go, then it's probably going to be the swan. It just might not be powerful enough. Swan's real good though.
Yeah, we can get a we can get a skunk for a little while. Okay, if this lands on the cat, yeah, we're in business. There we go. That's pretty good. We'll let the skunk lead the way. I guess we just keep the cat handy because the cat is seems to be buffing our, our ranks. Pretty good. Bison isn't as scary now. You can take him. Bison is incredibly scary again. We're okay. Mercy, thank you for the tier tree. Thank you very much. Oh my god, you're actually here on time. He's here on time. And we got a goat. Uh, the goat actually might be quite good, because if you buy a friend, you gain some gold. It's a, basically two free gold each turn. And I think that's the business we're in. Uh, I mean, I have to sell the skunk. I can't really get rid of the cat right now, because the cat is just, like, providing a bit of power. Get rid of the skunk. I think we pill the spider. Alright, yeah. Pop down a goat. Dog needs some garlic. Um, you know, you can survive a turn. We'll let you stay, Mo. Pop him back there. We'll just send this goat, no, uh, not send the goat out to die. Keeping these two, that, that tabby cat has to stay around. I kind of almost want to lose the next battle. I kind of want to lose it. Because if I do, right, I could sell him, buy two snails. Okay, let me, let me fuck this up real quick. Hang on. <laughs> if I lose this next battle, the stat increases I will get are insane. There we go. Let's just throw it here. There we go. Everything's gonna die to this one bison. <laughs> oh, are you kidding me? We got a draw. <sighs> oh, oh, come on, man, with your team. <laughs> I was trying to lose on purpose. <laughs> uh Come on. <laughs> Alright, rip the snail dream. The puppy. Uh, the bison would be good if we could finish off the chick. We should buy something, because we will get an extra gold. I could do the dog and puppy combo, but like that's a bad combo, because you want to be able to summon stuff. The bison feels like too late game, like it could just be a 6-6 that does nothing. And I'm wary of that. The bison I also need to keep ha keep about a long while. I, I think the, the rooster is probably best right now. Okay. Uh, I can just give this to the dog. <laughs> Keep that handy. Keep, I'll keep a pair. Oh no, the chick is doing a um, permanent. 
buff now. I forgot. Uh oh. Uh oh. Alright, this is going to be pretty much all up to the dog. Oh, come on! Oh, God damn it. The chicken. I could get like... Chicken rooster gang. Buy tier 1 pet, give future and current ones that. I don't know what I'm doing anymore. I feel like the dog has to be just become stronger. Um. Okay, I mean that that was kind of good. You buy a friend, you gain plus one and plus one. That's a better dog. <laughs> Arguably. Probably more consistent. The chick is close. Is that to the dog? We, we gotta go all in on him. Give plus one experience. Okay. That's, that's not quite what I thought you'd do. That's a really weird progression for the chick. Uh, the tiger cub. I mean, I can get the dog all the way up. I don't know what to pair the cub with at all. Like, th there's nothing really here that the cub benefits from. Oh, just go for it, dog. No. <laughs> Somehow, we were able to pull that off. I don't know why. Like, my team is terrible right now. I mean, I could snipe some folks. Maybe it's time to get rid of the tabby cat. Give one one to each pet of each tier. Honestly, that's kind of good right now. Just because we don't have much else going for us. <laughs> I think we actually get the poodle. There we go. I think it might be time for the goat to go as well. They repeat their ability in battle. None of them have battle abilities unless I get like invest in the sudden dolphins. <laughs> I can get a tiger and a dolphin, but I don't know if that's really that good. I mean, it's better than whatever this is. A poodle and a chick. I have to sell the cat then. Alright, goodbye cat. Served as well. See you later, goat. <laughs> this chick is like a real weird one. This doesn't help us at all in battle now. I don't think I like that ability one bit. Tiger needs to go here. I can level up the tiger, which is probably what I want to do, because that will just get everything more powerful. It, would, it won't work on the poodle. That's such a weird one. Um, I think here I just roll...
you'd be good if I had space, but I'd... Like, now it's too clogged, because I got this chick, I got this poodle, I got a tiger. Like, none of these do anything on their own. It's up to a dog and a dolphin. <laughs> Which is not a great combination. Okay, you know what? Here, I know what I can do. Here. Buy that. Get the owl. Buff. Sell owl. Buff. Get the bison. That's something we can work with. And now we level up the chick. Well, the bison. So that we can get another beefy unit on our team. And we just need to find a better application of this tiger. <laughs> Alright, it's the best we can do right now. <laughs> Pull us through this dog! <laughs> How are we winning? Our team is awful! <laughs> Oh, God. Okay, uh, we can get the bison up now. Uh, I guess we're gonna have to commit to the dolphin a while. I don't really see anything else here, uh, but that's fine. Let's move you. Oh, but then the tiger doesn't do anything. Okay, we'll level up the tiger then. Get you to level two. We get another bison for later. Okay, so we now have a contingency plan thanks to this the arrival of the mighty bison here. They have a dog as well. Oh, they're probably gonna win this. <laughs> Okay, I, I need to get my tiger just a little bit stronger. I also need to invest in my dog. You know, the melon armor really might be worth it on the dog. But no, we need we need we need, also need the garlic, so I'll just pop that on the bison. Pop that on the bison for now. Make him go sooner. Okay, we've almost got the tiger leveled up. Come on, gang, you just need to hang in there. <laughs> it's getting quite dicey here. Oh! Oh, that killed the butterfly. Oh, that's huge. <laughs> okay, I think we need to keep the dolphin about. Oh, now all the fucking dogs show up. <laughs> Where have you been? Level up gain plus eight plus eight. Oh, that's insane. That's a late game unit though. Make the dog stronger. Okay, I can make the, the tiger stronger. I think I have to level up the bison more now though. I can't put the chicken for, uh, for the dolphin because then we're just gonna die in the combat that's ahead of us. So I think what we do is we make guarantee that the bison is max level next round. Keep you handy. I probably should have kept that melon armor, it's fine. Maybe. <laughs> oh. oh, it's gonna be close! No! Ah. <laughs> uh. Why do we get the dog so late? I'm not trusting the dogs again. I'm not trust. I'm not going another dog. We're beaver gang now. We're beaver gang. <laughs> this is the obese tugboat. Let's go. You cannot stop this many. Oh, they've already won. Okay, we're gonna need more beavers. 
We're gonna need more. Give us another beaver. Take a fish. You cannot stop this many beavers. Oh my god, we're being massacred. <laughs> Okay, beavers combine! We have a turtle now. Give us a swan. Start a battle, make one enemy weak. Uh, takes three extra damage. It just doesn't seem like that does enough. If you have that with hedgehogs... My god, how many fucking beavers is this game gonna chuck at me? <laughs> we don't need this many. It's gonna be a level 3 beaver. <laughs> you know what? And we, we gear it up so he gets... He'll get, we'll give the beaver the melon armor. I actually have like a beaver teddy that's one of my favorites that I've ever gotten. I got him in like one of- it was like one of the five beaches of Normandy when we visited the museum there. And it's a Canadian army beaver. And his name is Corporal Flapjack Jr. And I love him. I got him when I was like 10 years old and I've kept him ever since. It's like one of my favorite teddies. Come on Corporal Flapjack, you can do this. Yeah, the melon armor is not going to help us much here. That's fine. Oh my god, we're just not getting the stats we want. Okay. Melon armor beaver. <laughs> Fucking max level beaver, why not? It's level three. <laughs> Why is it this strong? It doesn't- it, it, there's no need to be. There's absolutely no need. He's just cleaning up! <laughs> oh my god. Yeah, if we get a bison now, we can actually use it, which is insane. Uh, I should have pilled him before. Yeah, there's a puppy. I don't- I don't- You know what? No, just fuck the puppy. You suck. I'm tired of not having money. Get, like, get rid of the puppy. No one wants this guy. No one wants him. I'll take a sheep, happily. Uh, the tropical fish, I don't know if that's very good. I don't- I don't know what I'm really looking for here, or, like, in terms of people. I don't want that puppy. I, get him gone. Get- get him out of my sight. I can try roll something on- Oh, I can get another melon armor. Ooh. I can melon armor the swan. There we go. And then we get to pick one of these at the end. 
Uh, we'll just take a bat for now. Okay. Let's get him. Oh god, the armor. No! <laughs> no! I'm not taking you. No. I can get armor on another thing if I want it. I don't think that's worth it, though. Damn it, the puppy is probably the best thing to take. I really don't want it. No. I'm tired of the puppies. I'm tired of the fucking dogs. <laughs> I'm sick of your shit. We could take a cat. Cat might be handy. Is that for every bit of shop food it eats, it gives the buff? Keep that um, handy, Mo. Okay, hatchling chick, you're gonna be better than the fish here. We'll hop over to you in a moment. Fish isn't doing much. Get them gone. Look at that puppy, it did jack shit. Okay, make the beaver more powerful. <laughs> you can level up the cat. Probably makes more sense to put the, the bee on the cat. Actually, no, I just roll it for now. The owl is always quite good. Bison. We need that. I should have bought the owl first and sold it. Okay. Still, never punish. It still works out. Okay. The beaver will reign supreme. Buff it all up. Oh no, they've got a hedgehog army. Oh. <laughs> We're okay. Our guys are simply bigger now. Give that to you. I need the bison. I need to keep the swan at this point. I need to keep the beaver. The chick is keeping us alive and the tabby cat we've just invested a bit in. I really want to sell these owls off. Yeah, we got lucky there. Uh, yeah, there's not as much that I really like using in the in the DLC animals, honestly. There's a few really good ones. Like, I love the little chick. But, some of them, like, I don't know if the tabby cat is as good as some, like, the whale and stuff like that that you get in the original. The can't, now the can't, I, I don't really want to invest in the can right now. I want to try to get upgrades and stuff. I think that matters more. There's a swan. That's really good. Hey. Got him, beaver. Oh, he gave his stuff weak. That's actually really gonna help me more than anything. Alrighty. Okay, we get the mega swan now. Uh, the chicken. Buy one. That seems like it could really snowball out of control as an ability, but we don't really have the setup for it. 
We've been like we're we're already quite solidly invested in three of our teammates. Uh, I can feed the cat. If you have three or more gold, give all. T oh. Oh, I want that. Oh, yes. Okay. I think, I think the cat's gonna have to go then. So instead, we're gonna go from temporary plus two to permanent plus two. And we can upgrade it instantly. Oh, there goes all the melon armor. <laughs> Okay, cat's gonna take it for us. Okay, we need the T-Rex. Um, oh god, I could upgrade it, or I could just get three gold next turn. Like, honestly, three gold- having three just from the next turn, that seems pretty good. Yeah. I think I just take care of that right now. And then we do two rolls, and we stop there, because now everything gets stronger. Ho ho ho! Okay, take on the world. Come on, gang. Oh no. Oh no. Yeah, it's okay, we have one more chance. Give him some food. Another T-Rex is really good. I think we just keep that for later. I think the hatchling chick is gonna actually drop off and I think we even replace that soon. I think that has to go, because the plus five plus five isn't worth the slot anymore. We need something better. Oh, I should have kept the cow, yep. Yeah. Well, hopefully this isn't our last battle. <laughs> Come on. Oh, you got nothing. Okay, upgrade the T-Rex. Plus four, plus two. That's so good. Okay, we, we're looking to replace this chick. We buy a tier one pet. That really isn't going to come into play. Uh, I could invest in a worm. And we just start feeding it a bunch. Like a, it might be the best thing. The caterpillar is going to take way too long. I think we got a worm. Another bison. Food for the worm. Okay, buff them, T-Rex. Oh, they're getting so strong. <laughs> God damn it, we didn't kill that. At least the bison can clean up here. No! <laughs> no! <laughs> oh, we're okay. Forgot about the melon armor. That was a close one. Okay, we get some chocolate for later. We just keep buffing. This is like the better dog at work. Come on, better dog. Oh, good God! No! <laughs> That's a lot of buses! Oh, thank God we're okay. Oh, that was just, That was terrifying. 
There's just so many of them. Yeah, I think I saved that just so I can keep the T-Rex alive and it acts like a bee. Buff him. Yeah, we just have the big boy army, and that's what we're banking on. Oh, they have the llama. Oh my god, someone did it. It's dead. That's why you don't run llama. <laughs> they still won, though. Somehow, it's the badger's fault. Uh. Okay, I think I'm gonna leave it there. I think I think I'm good for tonight. That was really fun though. I I really enjoy playing this game. I hope you guys enjoyed watching it and just like kind of getting a grasp for it. Uh, if you want to get addicted like myself, the game is currently free. I have no affiliation with them. I just have a lot of fun playing it. And like, honestly, like, because like, there is like some bits of DLC that like, you can buy these guys for five bucks. I think these are the better animals. <laughs> honestly. Like, I, I prefer having like, th like this lineup, except for the badger. Uh, compared to like, some of the ones here. There's a lot more weird ones here, like the tropical fish and the buffalo. But, like the llama, the microbe. Like, the chicken. I haven't really used the chicken. Poodle. Like, I haven't used half of these guys. Yeah, it's really good fun. I would recommend. But I'm gonna hop off there for the evening. Thank you so much for coming by, folks. Uh, there's no stream tomorrow night from me. Uh, I am going to be getting some things ready for Christmas. I'm also going to be editing some other videos so you have something more to watch over Christmas. Uh, the next stream from me will be Christmas Eve. Uh, it's starting at 7 o'clock in the evening, and it's something quite special. Um, I thought it would just be fun. Um, we, we're kind of finished playing video games for the year, as far as streams go. Like, because the two Christmas ones aren't really video game-ish. Like, uh, like, you'll see what I mean when we get to them. But, uh, it's gonna be- I think it'll be fun. I think it's something kind of sweet. It's in a similar vein to stuff like how we do, like, a Lego set at Christmas. Where it's something very nostalgic that you might not have done in a while. Um, but it should be fun. There will be a Lego stream as well at Christmas Day. I do have something kind of quite silly for it. That I'm looking forward to just fucking about with. <laughs> You'll see what I've got then. Will you play Monster Hunter again? Uh, Rise comes out on PC in January, doesn't it? I'll probably be playing that then. Probably get a grab Kiwo for that too. I've just been waiting for that one to honestly just like kind of be ported from Switch. I think that was the plan for it. When's the Lego stream? Christmas Day. At 7. I'll be streaming at 7 both those days. It's just a like, different schedule this week because it's Christmas. I hope that's understandable. And the Christmas Day stream will be my last stream of the year too. And I'll be on break officially after that. Yeah, so Friday and Saturday are the next streams. Okay, let me see who's uh, streaming. I'll leave you in someone's care. Uh, who is all going? Uh, Josie is playing some Euro Truck Simulator. <laughs> sure, why not? Uh, go say hey. Okay, thanks for coming, folks. I'll see y'all Friday. If you want something more to watch from me, too, there's a video up on the YouTube channel in, like, 20 minutes. Um, take care, guys. See you soon.